Welcome, Nigeria. You have been uh, unfairly maligned, and you have one of your great ambassadors here. If you look at my book, African Development Reconsidered, in that book written 20 years ago, in it I say that the future of Africa is directly linked to the future of Nigeria as a leader in Africa. It, where I find the greatest shortcoming is that Nigerians themselves have not done a good job of telling their own story. And that story must be done, Mr. Minister, by people such as yourself and others to come here and to correct the impression of Nigeria in the American public and to show the great potential there is in Nigeria and the great opportunity that there is uh, for Americans who go there. Now, when I was deputy mayor of New York, I used to tell people when they came to my office, if you wait until Harlem is safe to go there, you will go there and it will be too late. If you wait until there is no risk in your investment, you will be there too late when you seek to have a risk-free environment. When Nigeria is risk-free, when you decide to go there, then you are too late. You need to go when there is a degree of risk and reward and they are directly related. This is what Americans understand too, too poorly, that the opportunities, Nigeria is poised on a takeoff that we may very well miss because we are concerned more about the risks than the rewards. And the Chinese have benefited greatly by that. 